Hello guys, Lego Gladiator here with another custom mock review. On what? This is a Spartan blockhouse. Kind of like the, um, kind of, if you read, if any of you read up on World War II, this is, World War I, this is actually a bunker. -y. The blockhouses were like machine gunner posts where soldiers would, where a bunch of, where machine gunners would shoot off a bunch of thoughts. So I thought I'd add it, make like a Space Wars version. As you can see, there's a, it's got an inside. Problem is, there ain't much on the inside. I might add some detail, some extra details. Anyways, let's go on to the details themselves on the base. If you look over right about here, there's word danger. Because there's a bunch of ammunition in this little box right here. There's actually, those same boxes are on both sides. As you can see, I have a lot. I like blue Spartan. I also have. Okay, let's start off with the figurines again. Master Chief. Normal, olive blue Spartan. Blue ODST. He also has some sort of gun or pistol. I don't know what it's called, but it's a Halo weapon. He also has a gun belt. A purple ODST that's actually female. She's armed with an assault rifle. Also has a gun belt like the other ODST. And finally, last but not least, the Green Spartan. He's armed with an assault rifle as well. Now on to the build. Here's a better view of it, so you get a view of what it looks like all the way around. And then... Now to the side. As you can see, there's an opening for the soldier to go in. There's also a chair inside. Sorry if there's no lights in there. I wish I could put a light in there. And of course, see if you look close enough. You can see the word danger. You can see the skull on it. The triangle thing, skull and crossbones. Meaning explosive. Now this is a actually this is one of my war gaming pieces. I sometimes war game with this. I have like a huge game board which it's not Lego made, but it's a old it's a huge game board kinda like a tarp you lay down. I use that as a war gaming board. It's pretty huge, but this is one of my game pieces. This is my blockhouse, which is kind of like an area where the soldiers can re can republish their ammunition. They can also rest for a few hours, maybe even. This is actually a little compared to, comparing this to my desert mock, though, to my desert outpost. This is actually a lot better than, a de than my Desert Outpost because the Desert Outpost is actually the idea of the Desert Outpost is it's actually a temporary base they pretty much used an old building and built fortifications around it this is a full on outpost which means it's not permanent it's permanent it's a permanent outpost, not temporary, which means anywhere it's set down. And of course, it's got a wall in the back. The wall design is actually for soldiers to hide behind so that they can have some time to rest. 
the inside of the building there's a place for a sniper to sit down or a machine gunner whichever is okay and of course there's the building now I might add like a little sliding door to make it so it shuts but I chose against that because I think it looks better this way if the doors just open now on the top you can see there's a place for a soldier to sit down and hide behind it's kinda like a barricade but it's a lookout area for a soldier to sit in I might add a lookout tower to this thing and just turn it into, into an outpost for now it's a blockhouse as you can see I've even put these little gate like things right here which kind of works as an extra barricade the idea is no enemy is going to be able to get this is kind of like a fencing you would a soldier can hide behind anyways now overall the design is based off it's pretty much what I really wanted to do though was make this as much farther I wanted to make this look completely different than I did my desert mock which is still in one piece anyways this is not the only thing I'm going to show off today though I was working on a kind of like a street scene then I, then I by accident made something on it Now, if none of you know what this pattern right here is supposed to indicate, it's supposed to indicate a skull. This is actually graffiti. This is supposed to be graffiti that somebody drew on the side of the walls. And as you can see, there's a block train station entrance. There's that. But this is actually just a street scene. I don't have a street light in it, but I'm not finished with it anyways. Well, that's it for today, guys. Comment, subscribe, share the videos. And if you want to make suggestions for my next build, let me know in the comments. I listen, uh, I'll listen to them. I'll listen to the suggestions. Anyways, just let me know.